this to floor. Tuskins is trying to reinvent the drop way, so I'm going to all the other dresses. We have some right here, and then another. Yeah, watch, Alice. And I think it can be very interesting yeah. with... No, I just, it's just baffling to me. Why is it so impossible to put together a decent run through? You people have had hours and hours to prepare. It's just so confusing to me. Where are the advertisers? Uh, we have some pieces from Banana Republic. Well, we need more, don't we? Oh, this is, this is what do you think? Yeah, well, you know me. Give me a full ballerina skirt and a hint of saloon and I'm on board. Oh, but do you think it's too much like... Like the Lacroix from July? I thought that, but no, not with the right accessories. It should work. Where are the belts for this strap? Why is no one ready? Here. It's a tough call. They're so different. Mm. <laughs> Something funny? It's, you know, it's just that both those belts look exactly the same to me, you know, I'm still learning about this stuff and, uh, this stuff? Oh, okay, I see. You think this has nothing to do with you. You go to your closet and you select, I don't know, that lumpy blue sweater, for instance, because you're trying to tell the world that you take yourself too seriously to care about what you put on your back, but what you don't know is that that sweater is not just blue, it's not turquoise, it's not lapis, it's actually cerulean. And you're also blithely unaware of the fact that in 2002, Oscar de la Renta did a collection of cerulean gowns, and then I think it was Yves Saint Laurent, wasn't it, who showed cerulean military jackets? I think we need a jacket here. And then cerulean quickly showed up in the collections of eight different designers. Uh, filtered down through the department stores and then trickled on down into some tragic casual corner where you no doubt fished it out of some clearance bin. However, that blue represents millions of dollars and countless jobs. And it's sort of comical how you think that you've made a choice that exempts you from the fashion industry when in fact you're wearing a sweater that was selected for you by the people in this room from a pile of stuff.